Hey guys, Justin, Avenged 55 Restorations. Uh, another little trivia video. Um, energy hogs. Biggest misnomer about vintage fridges is that they suck up a lot of energy. Um, I'm always battling against that because one of the coolest things about using an old, old fridge, other than, you know, looks cooler, um, and it's greener because you're not buying a new fridge every 10 years. You're using the same one, you know, that's paid off its carbon footprint decades ago. Uh, the coolest thing about them other than that is that they're actually more efficient than a modern day refrigerator for the most part. Um, and I caveat that. It's how you use it, where you're located, and uh, if you're taking care of it. So take an old, uh, an old, you know, refrigerator. And by old, I mean pre-1963-ish. Um, 1960s onward, they do start to become energy hogs. You get defrosters, defroster timers, you get blower motors, fans, uh, evaporator fans, all these different things that they basically were trying to, you know, make new technology in them. Didn't have it figured out right. So those ones are the worst. Um, it has all the, you know, they start to have all the modern conveniences, but while they were trying to figure them out, so they're not efficient at all. Um, pre that, these are manual defrost fridges, so you have to uh, defrost the freezers every couple months, um, and they're more efficient than a modern one. So basically what happens is they're on for 10 minutes out of the hour, they turn on until they reach the temperature you set it to, then they turn off. And at that point, you can unplug your, your refrigerator from the wall and it's doing the exact same thing. There's not even a light bulb on in it. So per minute, they take a lot more juice than a modern refrigerator, but, they're only on 10 minutes out of an hour. You know, a modern refrigerator has stuff running the entire time. So over a 24 hour period, your energy bill actually will generally go down unless you're leaving it open all the time constantly. And so it's having to constantly cool itself down again. Um, the other thing is if you're not maintaining it, that's where the biggest uh, uh, myth around that comes from is people with no door seal or blown out door seals. They're hard, they're cracked. Um, they're just gone, you know, eaten by rats or something. And at that point, your airflow is going back and forth constantly. So your fridge is going to be running nonstop trying to keep itself cool. And uh, then you will have an energy hog on your hands. But uh, stop harping on old fridges. They're good. They're good for the environment. They're good for uh, recycling. They're good for reusing. They're good for uh, carbon footprint. If you can use something that's already been made, that's greener than, make, you know, buying something new most of the time. Don't even get me started on cars. All I drive is old 50s and 60s stuff. But anyway, um, so energy hogs, busted. Have a good day, you guys.